I would absolutely recommend this to my friends. I'd say that it's so much fun. You learn so much about how soil affects like your everyday lives. It's just, it's a really laid back contest and it's just a good way to have fun with your friends. My name is Riley Wonderlick. I go to Canyon Lake High School. I am a freshman and I've been in 4-H for seven years. I've considered a career in soil science, so soil dating has left a huge impact on me. What we're really teaching young people when we have a soil judging contest is how to recognize the differences in soils and to understand why those differences are important. My name is Jake Maurer. I am an Extension Associate Professor in Soil Science at Texas A&M AgriLife Extension. Say, building a home, uh, a railroad, a road, a school, farming alfalfa, farming cotton, uh, raising cattle on it, or leaving it alone. What use is that soil best suited for? Uh, takes a little understanding of the differences and samenesses in soils, and that's what we're teaching. So that then when those young people grow up, they can say, no, you know, that's not the right thing to do with this soil. Or, yeah, this particular soil, this piece of land is going to be well suited towards that purpose. Love working with the young people and teaching them about soils. Well, I mean, I plan to live like out where I'll have land and this way I'll be able to myself, like I know who to contact if I need help with my land and I know myself what kind of land I have and I can test it myself. So I'm Brindley Broyles, I'm from Comal County and I'm a junior in high school. I've been participating in soil judging since fourth grade, so that would make it eight years now. I've learned sometimes not to second guess myself and just go with my gut. I mean, if you just like being outdoors and you're interested in just outdoors and farming, this is something that's so much fun. Like, cause you're just getting more in depth and learning more and more. The knowledge that you're learning, whether or not you use it the rest of your life or not, you're gonna be one of a small percent of people in the whole world that understand and know a little bit about a resource that is very important to our life. My name is Travis Weiser. I'm a soil scientist with the USDA Natural Resources Conservation Service out of Kerrville, Texas, and I am the MLRA leader for the office. You know, without soil, we wouldn't have the food, the clothes, the house you live in, the nice quality air we breathe and the water we drink all have an interaction in, uh, to soil. And so soils are very important. And just learning a little bit through soils is gonna give you a better understanding of the environment that we live in and the ecosystems that are around this world. So I would say don't be hesitant to, to start something new if you don't know anything about soils. Uh, there's agents around, uh, there's NRCS offices around that can help uh, guide and the best way to do it is to jump in and just start. Uh, when I started, my coaches didn't know a whole lot and so we learned as we did it throughout the years. So the word of wisdom is just to start it. Uh, you know, it, it is a contest that's outside. Uh, kids generally, you know, they like to be outside, you know, like, you know, I get to play in soil. My name is Ryan Elliott. I am in sixth, I have just finished sixth grade and I am from Washington County. Is this contest fun? Yes. Why is this contest fun? Because I get to play in the dirt. <laughs>